Sorry, but you're really the only one who's in- so interested in finding new members. Fuck, dude. The rest of us are like are fine like this. I know you're president and all, but you should really consider our opinion. Oh my god, she gets abused at home. Her dad beats her. Why didn't I fucking pick up on that? When she... Dude, fuck, I should have read the signs. I should have seen the signs. I guess it's harder. So when it comes to domestic abuse with children, usually the signs are mannerisms and not so much things that they say. Usually kids will kind of avoid hinting at their abuse at home, right? So I didn't pick up on it because she's made it so explicit in her voice and what she was saying that she was being abused. Because usually when kids are abused, they have like, mannerisms that like make them defensive like this like they're more defensive sure but that can also just be a trait right so like but really it's more like um the way they walk the way they say things you know um if you find like bruises in weird places if you find them crying over weird shit you know like a bunch of stuff like that but like when she said that her dad would kill her if he found the manga that was the first fucking clue into knowing that she was being abused at home that was way back in the first run of this game. Um, I should have known. That, okay, so she cuts. Sayori is suicidal. Natsuki is being abused at home. Monica fucking is the computer, I guess. Computer bitch or whatever. Oh my god! And that... Dude. That's why Natsuki's shirt is unbuttoned like that. That's a sign of abuse at home when your clothes is not in order like this specifically. Not messy like how a depressed teenager or suicidal teenager would have. But this fucking, it makes sense now. Holy shit. That's fucked up. I wonder if there's going to be like, like reveals of rape later. Shit. Anyway, going on. Monica is clearly taken aback by Natsuki's words. That's not true at all. I'm sure Yuri and Nu want to get more members too, right? Yuri fucking doesn't, dude. I fucking do. I don't know about Yuri, but I'm kind of indifferent. If I showed as much enthusiasm as Monica wanted, then I would probably be probably be lying. Still, if it's up to me to rescue this situation, um, no, Natsuki's right, isn't she? This club. What? She fucking interrupted me. It's nothing more than a place for a few people to hang out. Why did I think that everyone here saw it the same way as I did? But that doesn't mean that we're against getting new members or anything. New, why did you even join this club? What were you hoping to get out of it? He just wanted some fucking pussy, dude. That's all he wanted. That's all he wanted. That's, he just wanted some fucking pussy. Okay, let's be real. He just wanted to fuck it. She, he wanted to fuck this bitch with the big fucking milkers. He wanted to fuck this bitch. Okay, because he said she was cute or some shit. He wanted to fuck this bitch because she's way out of his league. And at one point, he even wanted to fuck the Sayori bitch. Okay? He just wanted some fuck. Let's be honest. He just wanted some fucking pussy. That's all he wanted. He wanted to have sex, dude. He wanted to fucking procreate, dude. (laughs) I'm sorry for making you laugh, Lad. Going on. Anyway, going on. Well, that's not really something I can be honest about. Is it? (laughs) I feel the need. The need to breed. There you go. Now we're getting into his fucking character. (laughs) In fact, if I remember, you weren't even given a choice not to join. Monica sits down and stares at her desk. What's the point of all this anyway? What if starting this club was a mistake? Now you've done it, Natsuki. What, me? I just spoke my mind. Is it a crime to be honest? It's not about being honest, it's about word choice. Besides, you have no right to speak for everyone else in the club like that. You don't understand at all. I just, I just want a place that feels nice to hang out with, with new friends. Oh, that's sad. Oh no. Okay, so here's what I'm guessing. The next arc is fucking Natsuki. She's going to be deleted next because that's really fucking touching. Okay, let me tell you right now. That's really fucking touching. Like... That's sad. Feeling alone like that because you're being abused at home, only having one outlet at school to escape to. All of this, man. All of this, really sad. That's, I like it. I like it. 
Is there a problem with the club being that for me? Oh, that fucking... She's, she's just finding a place for herself. That fucking hit me in the heart, man. Beautiful. There aren't, there aren't any other places like that for me. And now Monica wants to take it away from me. Shit. I like all these characters. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna be... I'm not gonna lie. I like all these characters. These are all touching stories. They, like, feel real. And I'm enjoying the game a little more now that it's, like, developing Natsuki's character a little more. Okay? Anyway. She's not taking anything away. No, Nu. It's not the same. It won't be the same with the direction she wants to take it. If I wanted that, then I could have just joined any other stupid club. Damn. But this one, I mean, at least for a little bit of time, things were nice. Damn. She gets picked on at home by her parents. They don't even like her reading manga in the club. I didn't sit with her and read her mangas this time. Like... Man, I've neglected her in this playthrough because I was like going for Yuri this time around. That makes me feel kind of bad. I mean, she's a sweet person. She, she just wants friendship, you know? Anyway, Natsuki starts packing up her things. I'm going home. I feel like I don't belong here right now. She's next? Are you fucking kidding? Are they all going to hang themselves? Are they all going to fucking hang themselves, dude? I don't want to string along several girls, dude. I just, I think that she deserves a friend, man. <sighs> Natsuki. Natsuki ignores Yuri and walks right out of the classroom. This is bad. I don't know what to do. Well, do you have an opinion on the festival? I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent, I guess. text i got the copyright text no that was that's been there turns out this game is copyrighted <laughs> i don't think i got another text that was weird that was weird and i'm just happy with you here but still i'm the vice president it's not right for me to ignore my responsibilities like that what dude i don't want her to kill herself what Look at her fucking crazy eyes, dude. I like this song, though. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> fucking Monica on the piano back there like, Yeah! Murder is amazing! You know? Fuck. Anyway, going on. <gasps> what the fuck? What happened to your eye? Open those fucking peepers! Open those peepers! Show me you're not bleeding! <laughs> I should do my best to consider everyone's perspective and make the decision that's right for the club. Open your fucking eyes! Okay, they're not bleeding. We're okay. But what about you, New? <laughs> what do you want to get out of this club? Yuri repeats the same question as Monica. I decide giving an indirect answer is better than nothing. I think the most important thing is for everyone to get along and for the club to provide something that you can't get anywhere else. I don't think it's about how many members, but rather the quality of each member. That's what will end up making the literature club a special place. You, I see. I really agree with you. Each member contributes their own qualities in a special way. With each... Whoa. Do it again, bitch. Ah. Why is her eye bleeding? Okay, new theory. Yuri and Monica working together.
With each change in members, the identity of the club as a whole will change too. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Stepping out of your comfort zone once in a while. So, if you would like to help Monica with the festival, then I'm on your side as well. Alright, well maybe we can all talk to Natsuki tomorrow. Yuri nods. Hey Yuri. Eh? Um, I know things were a little awkward yesterday, but I feel like you deserve to know that I still think you're a wonderful vice president. And also a wonderful friend. Monica, I want to do everything I can to make this the best club ever. Okay, me too. Yeah, let's all go home for today. We'll talk about the festival tomorrow. Okay, I look forward to it. Shall we go, New? Um, please don't take this the wrong way, but... I don't like this! I'm going to chat a little bit with New before we leave. Just to see what he thinks of this time here and all that. It's important to me as president. Yuri looks a little troubled, but she doesn't protest. Okay, I trust your judgment, Monica. In that case, I'll see the two of you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye, Yuri. Monica always as Yuri exits the classroom. Phew, things have been a bit hectic lately. You think? New, I just wanted to make sure you're enjoying your time at this club. I would really hate to see you unhappy. I feel kind of like I'm responsible for that as president. Is the screen getting dar darker? Or is that just me? And I really do care about you, you know. I don't like seeing the other girls give you a hard time. They are not giving me a hard time, Monica. Stop fucking killing everybody, please. Okay? I know you're masturbated with my pen. I get it. Okay? That don't mean shit. Anyway. With how mean Natsuki is and everything. I haven't seen her close her eyes like that. What the fuck? And Yuri being a little bit... You know. Ahaha. Sometimes it feels like you and I are the only real people here. Maybe, maybe I'm just in a fucking simulation with fucking Monica, you know? Maybe that's it. You know what I mean? But it's weird, because in all the time you've been here, we've hardly forgotten to spend any time. We've hardly gotten to spend any time together. That's true. That's a good point. Ah, uh, I mean, I guess it's technically only been a couple days. Sorry, I didn't mean to say something weird. There are just some things I've been hoping to talk about with you. Things I know only you could understand. So that's why. No, stop it. What? What? Hmm. Okay, Lust was the first one I saw. That was weird. That was weird, dude. That was really weird. Sensation? I don't even know what to think about that, dude. Grief? Wait, 1,111 out of 20, what? Excuse me? Misery. 11,111? What? Pure? What? 111,111? What? Nightgown? 1,111,111?! Flee? 11,111,111?! What?! Shiny? Is that the next one? Shiny? 111,111,111?! What?! Is Civet even here? Covet, you mean? I think Covet. One billion, one hundred eleven million, one hundred eleven thousand, one hundred and eleven. What? <laughs> Rose. 
111,111,111,111! <gasps> vertigo? Where's Vertigo? Wait. Pain, I guess, is the next one. Because I don't see Vertigo. 111 billion, 111 million, 111,111! What? A tone. <laughs> 1 trillion, 111 billion, 111 million, 111,111! Man, just click through all of them. We need to do them one at a time. Anyway, Sunny's next. 11 trillion, 111 billion, 111 million, 111,111! Sing is next. Here we go. 111 trillion, 111 billion, 111 million, 111,111! <laughs> captive is next, right? Where's Captive? There it is. 1 zillion, 111 trillion, 111 billion, 111 million, 111,111! A music. Eleven quadrillion, one hundred and eleven trillion, one hundred eleven billion, one hundred eleven million, one hundred eleven thousand, one hundred and eleven. One eternity late. What's the next one, dude? What, what's the next one? Joy. Okay, thank you. Oh! Ah! 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 Wait, Monica is here. What do you mean Monica's here? Where's Monica? The weird Oh! Huh? What? How many ones are these? Hundreds, thousands, millions, Billions, trillions, quadrillions, zillions, one zillion, one hundred eleven quadrillion, one hundred eleven trillion, one hundred eleven billion, one hundred eleven million, one hundred eleven thousand, one hundred and eleven. Wait, did I actually miss stuff because I was counting? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know what the fuck. I guess Fluffy was the next one, dude. I'm kind of upset. What's next? Wh which one next, dude? You guys get to pick. I'll let you. Fester. Where's Fester? There it is. Oh my god. What? What the hell? What in the fresh hell just happened? Hi, new. Hi, Yuri. What the fuck is up? Are you going to go masturbate to my fucking pen again? I've been waiting for you. Are you ready to continue reading? I brought my best tea today. Monica, I told you not to... Wait, what? That's not Monica. Ugh. Is she really late again? Inconsiderate as usual, Natsuki. Excuse me? Must you always interrupt my conversations with your incessant yelling? Wait, you're surprised what happened? What are you talking about? I'm surprised what happened? That fucking Sayori spirit is fucking haunting this game? Okay? Fucking... Anyway. You say that like I do it on a regular basis or something. I just wasn't paying attention, okay? I'm sorry. Seriously, what's gotten into you lately? Me? N nothing is it really that bad? I see it is something. I'll get over it. It's not even anything noteworthy. I've just been feeling a little on edge lately. Yeah, because you've been fucking, like, masturbating with my fucking pen, okay, lady? I'm not gonna get over that. Also, you've been cutting yourself in the middle of school day like a weirdo, which is also a form of masturbation for you, so there you go. A anyway, we don't need to talk about it. Well, I just felt like I needed to bring it up. It's not like I really care or anything. Aw, man, I'm the last one here again. Well, New just walked in too. Were you practicing piano again? Yeah. Ahaha, you must have a lot of determination. 
Starting this club and still trying to make time for piano. Well, maybe not determination, but I guess passion. It motivates me to work hard for the festival and, um, for me, right? You're trying to fuck me. You're trying to, that's why you're doing all this, so we can fuck, right? To fucking procreate. That's your fucking, anyway. Right, I, I forgot. Um, about that, Natsuki, we were all talking yesterday and, well, we decided that we would like to support the festival as well. However, I understand how you feel about not wanting the club to change. I think we all kind of feel that way. So as long as we're all working together, this club will never become something we don't want. I'm, I'm not, again, I'm not horny. Maybe this character is. I'm not being horny. I'm actually taken aback a little bit. Actually taken back a little bit. Anyway. Um, also, if you help us without, if you help us out with the festival, then I'll buy you a new manga. What, dude? She's buying her manga? Oh my god. Are, is they, are they gonna like, are they gonna start falling in love? These two right here? Is Monica making them gay for each other so that like, she can have me all to herself? Is that what's gonna happen next? Anyway, ah, sorry, that last part was really funny. Uh, look, I did some thinking about yesterday. I was a little more hostile than I meant to be. I guess I really felt threatened or something. But I know this is something we're doing together. Another new member wouldn't hurt as long as they're cool. And I guess another girl would be nice this time. But more importantly, I would hate to see the event suck just because I chose to back out. I'm a pro, you know. So I'm gonna help too, and we'll make sure it's done right. Thank goodness. Isn't that great, Monica? Monica? Where the fuck she go? She got, she's going and changing the fucking text watch. Another text is going to appear. Ah, yeah, that's wonderful. No, no text appeared, but... It wouldn't be the same without you, Natsuki. Anyway, new. what do you want to do today? I was thinking we could... We already have plans today. Fucking Yuri, don't do that, dude. This bitch is going to kill you. What the fuck? Ah, is that so, Yuri? That's correct. Nu is already engaged in a novel that we're reading together. It's about fucking torture, dude. I would not mind doing something besides that novel, I'm gonna be honest. Anyway. Aren't you glad I've already got him into literature, Monica? I... I suppose. I was just... Actually, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. She's pissed, dude. You guys can do whatever you want. She is fucking pissed, dude. She's fucking pissed. I keep looking at the files because I feel like they're going to change. Thank you for understanding, Monica. Actually, I have a request. Do you mind if I make some tea first? Not at all. Thanks very much. If there's one thing that can make my reading time here any better, it's a nice cup of tea. Not to mention for yourself as well. She makes her way to the closet. I follow and watch. Wait, this is the same text as before. Wait, I didn't see the face? What? Did I miss something? Shit, man. I guess I missed the face. Can you hold this for a second? Sure. Yuri hands me the water pitcher and also fetches the electric kettle. I'm going to plug this in at the teacher's desk and then I'll go get some water. She has info that could get Hillary arrested. What the fuck? <laughs> I simply watch her movements. This is blah 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 mannerisms, especially because her long legs. Blah blah. Okay, may I have the water pitcher? Thanks. I'll be right back. Ah, I might as well walk with you. Th that's okay. She's trying to fucking cut herself to masturbate, dude. She wants to get off. You stay here. It won't take long. Pitcher in hand, Yuri hurries out of the classroom. Ah, did Yuri leave you again? No, it's not like that this time. She's just filling up the water pitcher to make tea. Oh, okay. Sorry for misunderstanding. 10 minutes pass. Am I gonna see it again, dude? Am I gonna see it again? Why do I have to see it again? She's gonna go ha 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 and shit. Watch. Yep, there she is. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, she's fucking getting off by cutting herself. Why do I have to see this twice, man? I'm a little pissed that I have to see this twice. It's coming from around the corner. It sounds like breathing. <laughs> Are they in pain? I reach the corner and peer around it. Yuri? There she is again. 
There she is again, dude. She's fucking doing it again, dude. She's fucking doing it again, dude. It's the same fucking image, dude. Hello? Oh, wow! Wait, how did I... Sorry, I just had a really weird deja vu. This hasn't happened before or anything, right? My head has been a little fuzzy lately. I hope it hasn't really been showing or anything. I would hate for you to think I'm weird just after we started spending time together. I mean, everyone has a few unusual things about them. But expressing those things so soon after meeting someone is usually seen as inappropriate or unlikable. At least that's what I've discovered. When I was a bit younger, I think I would come on really strongly to get a little too intense. It made people not want to be around me. So I started hating those things about myself. My obsession with certain hobbies and the way I can't control myself when I get too excited about something. So I eventually stopped trying to talk to people. If nobody could ever like me for the things that matter most to me, then it's just easier if I close myself off. But recently something's been wrong. I don't know what it is, but every time we come to the club, my heart starts to go crazy. Like it's going to rip out of my chest. Is she gonna cut her heart out or something? That would be the only thing that I could think would be really fucking gruesome, you know? It overwhelms me with energy and emotions that I can't let out. It's been making me do weird things. I don't know why it's happening. New. I don't like that the music stops, dude. I hate that when the music stops. I hate when the music stops. I hate when the music stops. Is it just me or has Monica been acting a little off lately? She's always been a sweetheart ever since I joined the club, but recently I've been feeling something sharp whenever she's around. I'm not crazy, right? Oh, she's giving me the fucking crazy eyes. Please tell me I'm not. Uh, you're making kind of a crazy face. You're making kind of a crazy face, lady. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't say anything before because she's always listening. But finally, we're alone. Can we just stay here for a while? Um... Sure, why not? We can stay here, I guess. Yeah. Don't fucking stab me. Don't. Don't fucking stab me. Don't fucking stab me. Don't fucking stab me. Don't fucking stab me. I just want to stay here. Don't fucking kill me, dude. Don't fucking kill me, dude. Just the two of us. Don't fucking kill me, dude. Don't fucking kill me, dude. Please don't kill me. We can stay here until the club ends. Don't. Don't kill me. Don't fucking kill me, dude. Don't fucking kill me. And then we'll have the club room all to ourselves. She's gonna fucking stab me, dude. I knew she was gonna stab a bitch. I knew she was gonna stab a bitch. That bitch is gonna be me. She's gonna stab me. I'm the bitch she's gonna stab. She's gonna... She's fucking opening her creepy... Real life eyes, why are they blue if they were purple before? Nobody to interfere with our reading time. Okay. There's an eye in there too. Can you see the fucking eye? Inside of her fucking face? What is that outline? Here, can I turn the brightness up? Where are the settings? Is there brightness? Display? There's no like, brightness. I wish I could turn it up. Because I feel like... That's good. That's Soyura, right? Sa Sayori? Nobody to make me feel like stabbing myself in the throat. What the fuck, dude? 
What the fuck, dude? That's a fucked up thing to say, chick. Ah uh, ha ha! That was a joke. Ah! <laughs> Don't kill me, Monica! Help! Monica's showing up. Help! Monica, just a joke. Monica, fucking, you cannot come any sooner. Please stop her. Please, Monica, fucking, fucking get here. I do like knives though. Please, Monica, fucking show up right now, dude. She's fucking gonna, she's gonna fucking shank me, Monica. Please, fucking. I know I, I hate you. You're a bitch. You're straight up a bitch. But fuck it. You need to be here right now. It sounds strange, but you wouldn't understand if you've never seen how beautiful they can be. I have an idea. No! Monica, get here before she stabs me! Get here before she stabs me! Why don't you come to my house sometime? Okay, that's not as bad as, like, what I thought was about to happen. I can show you my collection. Okay. Okay. I've gotten them all from various artisans. I make sure to give them all their fair share of use. She's fucking crazy, dude. I don't want them to get lonely or anything. Nobody deserves to be lonely. Dude, Monica, can you like stop this, dude? Can you like fucking There's no new text or anything. Can you fucking Nobody. Ooh, okay. And that's why I'm so happy you joined the literature club, new. Now we don't need to be lonely anymore. Because we have each other. Every day. That's all we need. You know what? Let's quit the literature club. There's no need for us to be around Monica's slimy tongue anymore. Not to mention that other pathetic child. We can walk home together every day after school. And read together, eat together, sleep together. Doesn't that sound perfect? It's everything we could ever want. Isn't that why you joined the club in the first place? It's almost like it was fate. Fate that we would meet each other. And now we get the happy ending that I've patiently waited years for. Will you do that with me, New? <laughs> Anyway, Yuri first. <laughs> Finally. Ahaha, <laughs> Yuri holds my poem to her face and takes a deep breath. I love it. I love everything about it. New, I want to take this home. Will you let me keep it, please? Sure, I don't care. She's gonna fucking masturbate to the poem, dude. Fucking weirdo, man. Ahaha, <laughs> you're too nice to me, New. I've never met anyone as nice as you. I could die. No, not really, but I just don't know how to describe it. It's okay to be feeling this way, right? It's not bad, right? What the fuck happened with her eyes again? Yuri holds my poem to her chest. I'm going to take this home with me and keep it in my room. I hope that it makes you feel good when you think about me having it. I'll take good care of it. I'll even touch myself while reading it over and over. I'll give myself paper cuts so your skin oil enters my bloodstream. Ahahaha. You can have my poem too. Besides, after you read it, I know you're really going to want to keep it. Also, you're saying the bold letters are Monica, but I'm not interpreting the story like that, okay? The reality is, 
the reality has been altered since the game restarted okay the what what's actually happening here is that none of this is actually what's happened none of this is actually real this entire game is a fabrication at this point and that's why i'm not as invested in the character arcs these characters aren't actually developing in a natural way okay this isn't actually how you find out about yuri this isn't actually how you found out about her tragic past. Everything she's saying, everything she's doing, everything that's happening is just a fabrication by the fucking Monica being in my program files. I mean, it's, it's as simple as that. Honestly, it's as simple as that. And it's very, it's, it's kind of, that's what takes me away from my game. It's that I was enjoying reading a story and then they ripped that story away and put me into this alternate universe where Monica now controls the game files and it's like, okay. So, like, now what's the importance of it? If it's just one person telling the story from every angle, right, it's just Monica's perversions and Monica's story, then what's the point in finding out what's gonna happen. I mean, we find out what's gonna happen because it's kind of shocking, like, oh my god, she's touching herself with the poetry, you know? But at the same time, it's like, would it have been more satisfying to just get that thrown at you by Monica, or would it have been more satisfying to get that developed through a story, like learning about Yuri's traumas, however much of this is real, however much of this is not, through Yuri, through the festival, through the story of the literature club what happens after uh sayori's suicide you know anyway besides after you read it i know you're really going to want to keep it here take it i can't wait any longer hurry read it okay oh dude she pissed on this she pissed on this there's pee on this shit it's like blood and pee stains. Like she literally pissed on this. Do you like it? I mean, sure, yeah, it's pretty good. I wrote it for you. In case you couldn't tell, the poem is about... <laughs> More importantly, I've endowed it with my scent. You pissed on it, dude. I saw the fucking pee stain. See, aren't I the most thoughtful person in the club? I... I think I'm going to vomit. Oh my god, Monica made her do that. That's fucked up, dude. I feel bad for her because she's totally... See, her character wasn't like that. And that's what's so like... It's not... It's just off-putting for the sake of being off-putting. It's not off-putting for actual character development. That's fucked up. Monica's next anyway. Don't say I didn't warn you, new. Okay, Natsuki next. What? You gave your poem to Yuri? Gross. What is with you two? Humph. It's not like I wanted to read it anyway. It's just pissing me off a little bit that you didn't even think to show me at all. Ugh. Okay, I guess I'm going to share my poem with you anyway. I really hate that I have to do this. But unfortunately, I don't have much of a choice. Oh, hi, Daniel Strisco24. Hello, welcome. Just read it carefully, okay? Then you can't go away. Oh, this is the poem? Ed Zinger Suviante tells Hadness finished cop blah 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 blah. Okay, so it's gibberish mostly. Interesting. What? This isn't one of her cute poems. But anyway. I don't know how else to bring this up, but there's been something I've been worried about. Yuri has been acting kind of strange lately. You've only been here a few days, so you may not know what I mean, but she's not normally like this. She's always been quiet and polite and attentive, things like that. Okay, this is really embarrassing, but I'm forcing myself to suck it up. The truth is, I'm really worried about her. But if I try talking to her, she'll just get mad at me again. I don't know what to do. I think you're the only person that she'll listen to. I don't know why, but please try to do something. Maybe you can convince her to talk to a therapist. I've always wanted to try being better friends with Yuri 
injury and it really hurts me to see this happening. No, I'm going to hate myself later for admitting that, but right now I don't care. I just feel so helpless. So please, if you can do something to help, I don't want anything bad to happen to her. I'll make you cupcakes if I have to. Just please try to do something. As for Monica, I don't know why, but she's been really dismissive about this. It's like she just wants us to ignore it. So I'm mad at her right now, and that's why I'm coming to you about this. Don't let her know I wrote this. Just pretend like I gave you a really good poem, okay? I'm counting on you. Thanks for reading. Dude! Check DMs? I'll check DMs. Why the fuck not? What is that poem? Is that the poem that fucking Yuri wrote? Is that what you sent me? In the DMs? Is that the translation? Is it like in another language or something? Oh shit, that's the translation? In either case, um... Dude, but anyway, this chick, Natsuki or whatever, she's actually the nicest one. She's actually trying to help her friend. She's actually trying to help... She's actually trying to help her friend here. Oh no, she's fucking dead. I changed my mind. <gasps> no, Monica, no! No, Monica, no! No, Monica, no. Not Natsuki, dude. Not after I learned her fucking name, man. Fucking Nokia ass, bitch. Anyway. Ignore everything you just read. Oh, no. Monica's just... Is she deleted? Not yet. Shit. There's no point in trying to do anything. It's Yuri's own fault that she's so unlikable. She's not unlikable. I don't hate Yuri's... Wait, Yuri? Yuri's Yuri's not unlikable either. I don't hate Yuri's character. I hate what Monica's done to Yuri's character. Because Yuri is not like that. Can you hear me, New? If you would just spend more time with Monica, all these problems would go away. Yuri and I are too messed up for someone as wonderful as you. Just think of Monica from now on. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. Do I have to click that? I don't want to click that. I don't want to click that. Also, you guys say Yuri was crazy from the beginning, but she was not crazy at the beginning. Yuri was not crazy at the beginning. She was reserved. She was shy. Maybe she cut herself, okay? Maybe she was introverted, all right? But she wasn't fucking batshit crazy. It, she was not batshit crazy. Anyway, should I click this? Just Monica. Okay. Alright. Team Salt. What? Just Monica. <laughs> yes? No. Just Monica? Yes? No. Yes? No. No. That's. I think that's just Monica, guys. Okay, everyone, it's time to figure out the f <laughs> What the fuck, dude? Are the characters gone? They're not gone. They're still in the game, dude. If it's just Monica, then... What the fuck? <laughs> Let's hurry and get this over with. Jeez, why is the mood so weird today? Look, even Yuri isn't immune to it. What's wrong, Yuri? Stagnating air is common foreshadowing that something terrible is about to happen. Look, can we just get this done? I'm going to be printing and assembling all the poetry pamphlets. Natsuki, I was just thinking. I want to make cupcake cakes. Yeah, that. Glad we're on the same page. Yuri, you can. Well, it doesn't matter. Do whatever you want as long as you think it'll help. 
Monica, I'm not useless, you know. I know that. I already know what I'd like to do. We can't run a successful poetry event without having the right atmosphere for the occasion. That changed. So I'm going to make the decoration set up some nice mood lighting. I'm surprised there's not another fucking text that I can read at this point. Like, there's nothing in the game files right now that's new. There's nothing in the game files. Maybe, maybe I'm just not looking far enough. Like, there's nothing in here that's new. Can we point out Yuri's hips? What about her hips? What? She fucking curvy, dude. Yuri's got the hips, dude. Anyway, going on. There, see? That's a great idea. And that gives us all something to do. Eh? What about New? New is going to help me. Wait, you? You have the easiest job, Monica. Sorry, but that's just how it is. Like hell it is. What are you trying to pull? I, I agree with Natsuki. Not only is your work already most suitable for one person, but my task is laborious enough to benefit from an extra pair of hands. Mine too. What? Your cupcakes? Please. Like you would fucking know. All you care about is dragging New around with you and your stupid books. Okay. You and Monica. Hey, I didn't even do anything. Okay, then why not let New decide who to help instead of abusing your power? I'm not abusing my power. Yes, you are, Monica. Oh shit, dude. Just let New make the choice, okay? Okay, fine, fine. Jeez. New, I know how fed up you are with these two by now. We can just... Natsuki, shut your fucking mouth and let him decide for himself. What the fuck, dude? You shut your mouth. Jesus Christ, this is never going to end. Just make the choice, okay? Oh, it's dragging me towards Monica, dude. <laughs> it's dragging my mouse! It's dragging my fucking mouse. I, p I clicked Yuri. What do I even, what do I even do? What do I, it's just Monica. <laughs> I'm gonna click on this. Well, I want, I want to click on Yuri, dude. Is there a history I can look at? What the fuck? Okay, I'll click on this one. Yay, you picked me. We can meet at your house this weekend. I promise it'll be fun. It's Sunday okay with you. Are you fucking kidding me? This isn't fair at all. It is fair, Natsuki. Fucking Natsuki is the only one that fucking... Like... <sighs> this is what it feels like to be in an abusive relationship. Damn it! Anyway. It's what he chose. No, it's not fair. Giving us all this work and then taking new for yourself. What a shameful thing to do. Yuri, I didn't even give you any work. You decided it for yourself. You're being a little unreasonable here. I'm being unreasonable. Oh shit, she making the crazy face again. She making the crazy face again. Ah, <laughs> Monica, I can't believe how delusional and self-important you are. Dude, stab her. Stab her! Pulling new away from me every single time you're not included in something. Are you jealous? Crazy? Or maybe you just hate yourself so much that you take it out on others. Dude, Yuri's like fucking. She's attacking people, dude. Here's a suggestion. Have you considered killing yourself? I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to fucking say here. That's fucked up. It would be beneficial to your mental health. What? What? Yuri, you're scaring me a little. Yeah, I'm with Natsuki here, dude. Natsuki, let's just go. I don't think she wants us around right now. See, that wasn't very hard. Y 
Yeah, Yuri would go off in Modern Warfare 2 lobbies, dude. <laughs> All I want is to spend a little time with him. Is that so much to ask? Yuri follows Monica and Natsuki to the door. Hey, Nu. Yuri is really something, isn't she? Monica giggles as Yuri pushes her out the door. Am I going to get fucking killed here? Finally. Fuck. What's that sound? Do you guys hear that breathing? Do you guys hear that fucking breathing? What the hell? Anyway. Finally, she says. Okay, crazy bitch. This is really all I wanted. To fucking breathe? New, no, there's no need to spend the weekend with Monica. Don't listen to her. Just come to my house instead. The whole day with just the two of us. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Okay, crazy bitch. Wow, there's really something wrong with me, isn't there? Yeah, I think you noticed that too. There oh my god. There's a new text file. I don't even know what to open it with. It's just a file. It's called Have a Nice Weekend. Do I open it with WordPad? I guess? What is this? It's a bunch of letters, so I'm gonna copy it, paste it on, on my browser. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 that's not what I wanted. Did I fuck something up? Just use text editor? To open it? Like notepad and shit? Shit? Notepad? Like, what do I do with this? This is what came up. So I opened this file, it's called Have a Nice Weekend. Let me show everybody. So I opened this file and this is what comes up. What do I do with this, people? Like, what do I do? What, what do I do? I'm like actually at a loss, like. I don't know what to do here. It's in base 64, is it? Let me see. I'm going to copy it. Okay, let me go see what it is. Let me see what it is, okay? There's got to be base 64 decode. It's not in base 64. I don't think it's in base 64. Just don't worry about it and keep going. Really? One moment. Yeah, this fucking file doesn't work, dude. I don't know. I'm worried about it. I want to see what this have a nice weekend file is. Maybe it's like a... Paint file? The file name is have a nice weekend. That's the file name. Should I open it in an emulator? <laughs> I wanna see what this is, dude. I wanna see what this is before I go on. It just popped up. Like, I wanna see what this, I mean, can you blame me for wanting to see what this is? For wanting to show you guys what this is? Like, I guess I could open it in paint. I'm gonna try that. No? So it's a text file for sure. WordPad. Copy. I'm going to look up code decoder. I'm still looking this shit up, dude. It's a visionaire cipher?
what is a visionaire? What, so it's Java code? There's an online decoder for this. Boop. Decrypt. Oh, what's the key password? What the fuck? is this dude answers and dms okay i'm gonna look at the answer okay this is what it is it says what is a man without knowing the rich aroma of the future the hot complex balance of the present and the bittersweet aftertaste of the past honestly that wasn't that worth it that do that wasn't that worth it that wasn't that that wasn't that worth it i don't know why i was like so intent on knowing that but I had to know, you know? Like, when you're playing a game like this, you just have to fucking know, you know? Anyway. But you know what? I don't care anymore. I've never felt this good my whole life. Just being with you is a far greater pleasure than anything I could imagine. I'm addicted to you. Of course you are. It feels like I'm going to die if I'm not breathing the same air as you. Doesn't it feel nice to have someone care about you so much? To have someone who wants to revolve their entire life around you. But if it feels so good, then why does it feel more and more like something horrible is going to happen? Of course something horrible is going to happen, dude. Monica's making this whole thing happen. Maybe that's why I tried stopping myself at first, but the feeling is too strong now. Oh, she's going to fucking stab me. She's going to fucking stab me, like, over and over again. Like, there's no way. I don't care anymore, New. I have to tell you. I'm, I'm madly in love with you. Okay, well, that's not so bad. It feels like every inch of my body, every drop of blood in me is screaming her name. Okay, a little obsessive, but okay. Okay. I don't care what the consequences are anymore. I don't care if Monica's listening. Please, New, just know how much I love you. I love you so much that I even touched myself with the pen I stole from you. I knew it. I fucking knew it. I just want to pull your skin open and crawl inside of you. Ew. I don't like that image. I want you all to myself. And I will be only yours. Doesn't that sound perfect? Tell me, New. Tell me you want to be my lover. Do you accept my confession? She's kind of crazy, so I'm just going to say yes. Why did the music stop? She's laughing like a maniac. Ah. I'm gonna die. <gasps> Why is she doing that? Wait, no, no. Why is she doing this? Huh? Monica made her kill herself, I guess. What? 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 So Monica killed her, right? That's what happened? Is she deleted from the characters yet? No, she's not. What? I'm not gonna use the skip, dude. Like... This is fucking stupid. I thought this was actually gonna be like her trying to kill me. Not that she would fucking kill herself. Monica just killed- This is what the problem with this game is! This is what the problem is! These characters have been beautifully and masterfully dis developed, okay? They've been beautifully and masterfully developed. And then... And then... Fucking... Like... It's ruined by this, like, 
cyber bitch that can change the files and make her do this. Like... Like, what the hell? This is stupid. This is a stupid way to resolve her character. This is a stupid way to 